Hi folks, Sonia Ash here from Ash Design. Today I want to show you how to use our Designer Gem Angel Wing overlays. So we're going to start with this photo and you can see that I've got two layers here. What I've done is I've gone ahead and I've cut out my subject and I'll show you just by turning off the background. You can see she's on her own layer. What we want to do is we want to put the angel wings in between these two layers so that they go behind her. So in this file I've got um, angel wings open. I'm going to make sure I have my move tool selected. I'm going to click on the angel wings. I'm going to drag it up to my image tab, bring it down on the canvas and drop it in. And from here what we can do is we can um, scale it. So control T on your keyboard and while you're holding down your shift key grab any one of these four corners to scale this proportionally. And we'll get that kind of what we wanted. I think that's pretty good. Hit enter on your keyboard. All right, and that will apply that. Then we'll just sort of get it in place here. Now, I think these are a little bit bright for this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, come up to image adjustments and we're going to uh, click on the levels. Now with levels, I'm going to move that aside. We can bring down the brightness. So I'm going to start by using this middle slider and I'm going to slide it this way and you'll do this just to where it suits your image um, and we can bring up the light areas if we want to I actually think I'll leave that right where it was and then the darks we can bring that down even further if we want to get a little bit more contrast in there um, and then if we click on the preview this was the before and that's the after and that really fits in there a lot nicer and then you also have the option to um, bring down the opacity somewhat if you'd like to, just to sort of make it, make it fit into your um, composition a little bit better. And that's it. Um, pretty simple to use the uh, angel wing overlays. Mm -hmm.